This video was made possible by a subscriber named Samwise, who left a comment showing the names of minor factions. Thanks, Samwise. We finally know what some of the minor factions will be like and what they will be called. By the looks of them, I don't think that these factions will hold lots of land, rather more act like gangs or groups of people that serve their own home. There are probably loads of side quests to do with them, like in Skyrim, the side quests with the Dark Brotherhood, or the Thieves Guild, but let's get into the names. In the video uploaded on May 18th by PC Gamer called PC Gamer Weekender Mountain Blade Bannerlord Presentation with Gameplay, at 540 there is a location called Hidden One's Base. Why I earlier said that these minor factions don't look like they will be taking on territory is due to these names. The Hidden Ones sound more like a guild than a faction, so maybe these groups of people should be more properly named guilds. But anyway, my theory for the Hidden Ones could be something like the last remaining few of a faction that was destroyed. Maybe these people are being hunted, or maybe they're assassins that are never even seen by their victims. At 602, the Brotherhood base is seen, which me sounds more possibly like a warrior or fighting guild. Somehow I doubt that they will be anything more like the Dark Brotherhood from the Elder Scrolls. Also at 602, distantly you can see the Lost Legion, possibly a group of deserters who have started their own guild, free from their old governments. At 1952, you can distantly see one in the distance that is too hard to read. It must be the Brotherhood of Butter. It's gotta be. Come on King Harless. Let's see it. Let's see it man. At 1953, you can also see the Free Company base. All of these factions or guilds sound quite similar, the Brotherhood, Free Company, the Lost Legion. As Samwise pointed out, they seem to be something other than real factions. They seem to be more like mercenary camps, where you can go to quickly hire an army. Maybe Tail World is trying to fix the problem from Warband, where if you lost your whole army, it would take a tremendous amount of energy and time to get a new one if you didn't have one garrisoned in a base. Maybe you could just walk right over to the Brotherhood as a rich man and hire a whole army, like Stannis from the Game of Thrones. Except, hopefully they won't rout this time. Or possibly, they are criminal organizations, aimed at trying to help the player make more money, eliminating the hassle of killing looters and thieves until you have enough money to buy a shop in a big city. You could instead work with the Lost Legion for a while and build up some cash flow. We already know that organized crime is a thing in cities, so it makes sense that it is a thing outside of the castle walls as well. I don't think minor factions in Bannerlord are going to be as cool as we think, or wanted them to be. They won't be able to take castles or reign under their own flags, but they will provide help for the player when needed and provide you with things like troops and money and quests. The mercenary system in Warband was pretty garbage and they should have had a better one in the first place. These factions will provide a better way to make money and get an army, and I don't think that kingdoms will be able to interact with them. This is quite disappointing for me, but still makes sense. I would have loved to see a crumbling nation fall into civil war with a minor faction within its borders, or watch a minor faction finally move and take a castle from the Empire, sparking a new nation. We probably won't get that, so get on it modders. Thank you all for watching guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Sorry it's been a little while since I put out a theory. Um, this actually isn't a theory, it's just kind of looking at the names and stuff. But um, if you enjoy these kinds of videos, make sure to leave a like and tell me in a comment if you have a video idea or you've seen something in one of the demos that kind of sparked something. Um, or if you just want to hear about something that you want me to talk about. But yeah, thank you all for watching and I'll see you all next time. Peace.